Um, Doc, I'm sorry. My aunt just texted. No worries. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. I'll be back in a few hours. Hi, May. Let me guess. Running late? Nope, I'm actually on my way now. Have you heard from Miles? No, but his mother said he was coming, so... Good. I'll be there soon. Bye! What are you doing here? Oh, we got a fighter. You just made your last mistake, Hong. What the? Does it seriously take this many guys to rob a teenager? You hurt? You're Spider-Man. You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. And a few other choice adjectives Jameson uses. Look, that was really brave. But next time, leave the fighting to the pros, okay? Uh, okay, but what if there aren't any around? Well, you can't just go swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time, but when I do it, I have... Oh, oh, like that time you fought Rhino on the Brooklyn Bridge? That was so awesome. Perfect example. <laughs> if the other guy's bigger, you gotta be quicker. Okay? Okay, but that's... It's easy for you to say. I, sorry, I just can't do what you do. All right, put him up. Seriously? Yeah, come on. First thing. Don't let the adrenaline get to you. Breathe slow, breathe deep, relax. Hip square to your opponent. Let them make the first move. Now use your feet. When they go off balance, look for an opening. Boom. Like that? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Okay, Not only this time, just let me have it. Right on the jock, okay? I can <clears throat> Oh, sh... S sorry. No, 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 <laughs> it's all good. You keep that up and uh, you'll be fine. All right, lesson's over. Gotta go. Hey, uh, thanks. You know, anytime. I just punched Spider Man. Shelter should be just ahead. Yo, Miles, what's up? Bro, you're not gonna believe this. I just met Spider-Man. What? That's crazy. Hey, did you show him our hacking app? Oh, man. I totally forgot. Oh, he sucked. He totally would've bought it off you, and then we'd be, like, famous. Yeah, I'll show him next time. I, I gotta go. I promised my mom I wouldn't be Everyone late. have their IDs out. Cool. Ready for Later. inspection. You gotta be kidding me. It's gonna take forever. Drone wasn't watching. I could jump the fence. Wow, that was too easy. I can't believe Sable systems are unsecured. Maybe I'll send an anonymous tip. Okay.
Okay, hacking app. Don't fail me now. Okay. Okay, time to move. the gate on the left, or over the scaffolding to the right. Nope, let's try a different way. Oh. The scaffolding will work. Less terrifying. Oh, they're not messing around. Whoa! <gasps> Those things have mounted guns? I can't let them spot me. So cool. It was less terrifying. Come on, ignore me. I'm invisible. Oh, they're not messing around. Where are the real cops? <clears throat> okay, I'm in the clear. That was intense. Oh, hey, Mom. Hi, honey. Did you make it to the thief shelter okay? Uh, yeah, almost there. Miles, you don't have to work at that shelter, you know. You said I did. No, I gave you a choice. Yeah, and I chose this over more therapy. I mean, it was helpful. The guy said everyone grieves in their own way. But this is mine. Okay, sorry. Mom. Yeah? Just because I don't want to talk about it doesn't mean I don't love you. Oh, honey. I love you so much. We'll get through this. Okay? I gotta go. I'll call you on my way home. I'm seeing, seeing death, dead demon faces. And you know what? Just, just keep breathing. I'll be back soon, Mr. Hey, hey, Miles. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no. I'm just glad you're here. All right, so, um... What can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, getting comfortable with the place. Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee? All right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure? Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic? It fits. Good one, kid. Piece of junk. <clears throat> oh, hell! Damn hunk of junk! Uh, you mind if I take a look? Eh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these CR when they're... CR what? No, no, you just gotta smack it a couple times. Get it. 
going. Or could be a loose coax cable. All right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr. Smarty Pants? Hey, please, go ahead. Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerge that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. Hey, new kid. I'm empty wife, here. Rio and son Miles, as well as brother Aaron. In addition to the hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. <laughs> hey, Ernie. I see you've met Miles. He's gonna be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Uh, listen, Cat, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. Let's see if Ant-Man needs a hand in the kitchen. Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh... Brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. Nice to see you. Well, grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Hey, hey Peter. Um, thanks for that back there. Of course. Almost noon. Sable should be moving Dr. Michaels. Better get to the Bowery and locate him. I'm afraid our computers are a bit outdated. Oh, that's cool. Hey, Yuri. I'm heading to the Bowery to make sure Michaels gets to his new safe house. You know, safely. I wouldn't do that. Silver Sable made it clear you are not welcome. Yeah, well, what's she gonna do? Shoot me? Honestly, 50-50 chance. Ah, fine. I'll be in the neighborhood, but not too close. Just in case. This is the Bowery, but where's Dr. Michaels? Okay, be straight with me. If this devil's breath gets loose in the... We're ready for you, Dr. Michaels. Is that the devil's breath? It's called GR-27, not... <sighs> Just be careful. 
In the wrong hands, this could... Don't worry. We're the best in the world. <sighs> I feel better already. Code 381. Package is on the move. This way, Dr. Michaels. What the hell is that? Welcome aboard, Doctor. Get off me! We got this! Yeah, sure you do. I'm in pursuit of Martin Lee. I think he's got Dr. Michaels and the Devil's Breath. Copy that. More units coming your way. He took Michaels alive, so that's good. Probably so we can force him to make more Devil's Breath. I have to stop that truck. Tank, whatever. <laughs> Clear the guys in the trucks before I go after Lee. Keep shooting! Hey, stop shooting! Coming, and he will destroy all sinners! Sorry! Lee, hand it over! Be honest. 
I was hoping to bring you here. My abilities lend me a certain persuasiveness. I've been watching you. I was waiting for you at City Hall. You never came. Where were you? Is this real or in my mind? It was a shame so many had to die with no heroes to save them. That officer saved your life, didn't he? He was here because of you. And Norman wanted to use him. A futile gesture, in the end. And where was Norman during all this? Slinking away like a rat. He knew what was going to happen, and he fled. Norman is a hidden cancer on this city. He must be excised with no trace of his corruption to return. Norman hides behind his massive lies. I will break it apart and drag him into the light. Put on the mask. Become one of us. Thanks, but no thanks! One way or the other, you will join me. Oh. Victims you couldn't save. No. Martin, their blood is on your hands! You can stop Osborne. You have so much strength. I can give you his will. <laughs> their bodies filled the gutters, and you did nothing! I can't save everyone! What's one life now? A simple trade. One life for a city of souls. You defend Osborne while he sits in his ivory tower? This isn't real. Show me your true strength! Kneel before me! I will pull your mask off and expose you! The shadows are sworn to me! I the strength. What? I used to destroy the mask. I won't abandon you in the darkness, Martin. I will break you and leave you break. You can't. You can come back to the light. I will. No. Okay? Did they take it? Yes. How worried should I be? Very. You're a popular guy. Where is the serum? I'm gone. The Discoya! So-called superhero. You think you save people, but you just make it worse. This is your fault. My fault? He was under your protection. Do you really need two of those? <laughs> Stop! We need to brief Mr. Osborne now. I'll go with her. Thank you. 
I'll remember this. Yuri, tell me you've got a lead on Martin Lee's location. We have footage from a guy at a coffee shop. Looks like he hopped into a black sedan after the crash. Black sedan, great. Let me finish. We have a partial plate. And one of my patrol guys just found a matching plate. Black sedan in a parking lot near Canal and Hudson. You're a good cop, Yuri. I'm on my way. Spider-Man. Hello? Is this working? Dr. Michaels? How are you calling? Borrowed on one of Sable's radios. Listen, transit hubs are the most likely release points for Devil's Breath. Airports, bus terminals, train stations. It'll spread like wildfire from there. Why the hell is Oscorp developing a bioweapon in the city? Shouldn't this be in an Arctic bunker? Devil's Breath is personal for Norman. It's been his obsession for decades. The project breaks every state and federal regulation on the books, but he doesn't care. If the city finds out, he can kiss re-election goodbye. Never mind re-election. He'd be tried in The Hague for war crimes. Why are you telling me all this? Aren't you just as culpable as Norman? Yes. Completely. But Lee's actions have been a wake-up call. We've ignored the project's risk for too long. I trust you, Spider-Man. You're the only one trying to do the right thing. Please, protect the city from our mistakes. Doc left word. Parker, I wanted to thank you. Your work on the neural interface has been invaluable. I wish you could see what that means right now. But it's beginning to dawn on me just how powerful and insidious the forces arrayed against true visionaries are. I promise you, though, it won't be long. Success will come, whatever it Sorry, takes. Sorry, spider emergency. Powerful and insidious forces. I don't like the sound of that. Need to check on Doc when I get a chance. Damn. Devil's breath is gone. I should call MJ and Warner. This is Mary Jane Watson. Please leave a detailed message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. What are you up to now, MJ? Standish said the demons are looking for something at GCT. But what could they possibly need here? Should probably call Peter and let him know what I'm doing. Actually, scratch that. He'd probably just tell me to go home and chain myself to my laptop. I'll just check things out quick and let him know what I find. Look at all those Oscorp displays. Hmm, looks like an Oscorp Tech Expo. Just a few years ago, optical camouflage was the stuff of science fiction films. <laughs> so cool. But with Oscorp's patented magnetic resonance arrays, cloaking this fields are very it's much a reality. Try it for yourself and see how Oscorp is making your world better. I'll take three of these right every now. Day. How much do you think they cost? Incredible. Stay clean and use the approach. It's cool and all, but damn. Oscorp's Revolutionary Medical Evacuation Drone, or MED, offers immediate emergency assistance, even in the most hostile areas of the world. Visit the customer service counter for more details. Oscorp's research and development team are hard at work on a radical new form of battery that recharges itself from sound waves. From paper cuts to gunshot wounds, Oscorp's patented nanotechnology can increase the body's healing rate by 1,000 times. We're not just saving you money, we're saving lives.
of kiosks throughout the terminal. This Gaia microbe dispersal device releases specially formulated microbes into the atmosphere and in turn leaves our oceans and rivers cleaner than when man first walked the earth. Mr. Lee. This will be easier for everyone if you remain calm and do as I say. Police! Over here! Office. I would like to speak to Mayor Osborne. Who's calling? The man he is looking for. What do you want? I want you at Grand Central Terminal in 30 minutes. By yourself. Or there'll be more blood on your hands. I'm on my way. Are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Just hurry. Going as fast as I can. What are you doing at GCT? I'll explain later. Listen, Lee's going to release the Devil's Breath. You gotta get out of there. He's not gonna do it until Norman Osborne gets here. Wait, this must have been Lee's plan all along. Make Norman responsible by forcing him to release the Devil's Breath himself. Sort of makes sense, in a twisted, psychotic way. Okay, I'm here. Coming into the terminal now. Anything I should be on the lookout for? Please, don't hurt us. Where the hell is Spider-Man? Looks like he's got some drones patrolling. Guess he's prepared for you. Don't worry, I'm in the ventilation system. Can you see a safe exit point? Southwest corner. On my way. Get any closer, the drones will spot me. See that tablet I'm looking at? That controls the drones. Yes, if you can distract them and not get shot. I'm ready. Tell me when. Okay, I'm ready. Incoming. You mean shang swallow ma? I have a direct line to Mayor Osborne. I can help make sure he arrives on time. How? First, let him go. They're coming. 
Jump over the railing. Can't let him see me. <laughs> 